My friend got me suckered into the recent prostitution sting. We had this in our news yesterday, Ebony. Some, I think, 47 people were arrested on prostitution, promoting prostitution, and a bunch of other charges. This guy said, this person, John from Perry County, says, I got suckered into the recent prostitution sting. I don't know what that means, but what can I do? I don't have any previous charges at all. What do you both advise? Ebony, I mean, that's a little out of your area, but both of you give me your thoughts on it. Uh, well, I can tell you one thing. He needs to get a good lawyer. <laughs> Tonight. That's, that's numero uno. Yeah. All right. So once you get a lawyer, that you're going to have two options, basically. One, and I'm not suggesting that you do this, but I, the authorities are forever wanting you to turn evidence, and they'll make it easier on you if you do that. So that's one thing you can do. But by having a good lawyer, that lawyer talks to the district attorney's office, and it could be that they can plea bargain it down some or get you a good suspended sentence or probation or something so you know that you get, you get your money's worth if you buy if you go hire a good lawyer and no no previous record if that's the well, case help. that that's a big yeah, deal it, it is a big deal it's a big deal it's a plus for it absolutely yeah yeah and so this is more embarrassing than anything else on your record it's not as bad as a burglary or a robbery or you know one something of the big else. felonies right but um, still not good. It's not still not good. That's right. And I'll, I'll speculate for this John who called in. A friend could have said, "Hey, would you mm -hmm. take this girl over to that place?" Sure. And that may and he may have gone, "Well, yeah, I guess I will." And I'm just speculating that could be a scenario. Yeah. But man, I'd hate to go home tonight and go, "Hey, honey, yeah. I need to tell you something. Sure, I've been yeah. arrested on yeah. prostitution solicitation yeah. or something." Oh my goodness. Yeah, and the way I our laws imagine. are structured, Mike, just that's, your example is right on point. You don't have to actually do commit the crime. If you assist, aid, and abet in any way, they can charge you. So for my it. example wasn't too bad. No, it was no. very good. Even if you had knowledge that, hey, this buddy of mine is involved yeah. in this, and I'm doing him a favor by taking this girl to the exactly. airport or something else, you're complicit. You're, you're involved. Not, you're helping. You're involved. You know, you're involved with one of the parties, and you're helping.